fifth ranked Georgia welcomes FCS opponent Georgia Southern to Sanford Stadium. The Bulldogs have certainly found their way in the second half of the season. In the past three games, the Bulldogs defense has limited their opponent to a single touchdown and four field goals. In last week's match, not only did they shut out Auburn for the first time since 1976, but they also clinched the SEC East Division title for the fifth time in program history. Welcome to Game Day Central. I'm Megan Clemente. Georgia sets the tone of this game. Aaron Murray finds Arthur Lynch. Lynch gets the catch and takes it 49 yards up the sideline. It leads to a touchdown. The Bulldogs lead 7-0 after the opening quarter. Georgia Southern finishing what had started late in the first. Dominique Swope rushes down the middle, diving into the end zone. His knee hits the ground one yard shy of the score. No problem. Jarek McKinnon completes the drive. Score is all tied up at 7. The Bulldogs have no plans of this being a close game. Last play of the half, nine seconds on the clock. Murray connects with Malcolm Mitchell. Uh, make that girly. Here is Malcolm Mitchell, touchdown! Bulldogs lead 17-7, and from that point on, they never look back. Third quarter brings three more touchdowns for Georgia. The last, a 33-yard pass from Murray to Chris Connolly, marking a 55th touchdown for the Bulldogs this season and setting a new school record. The Bulldogs get their 10th win of the season with the final 45-14. Aaron Murray completes 18 passes for 330 yards and four touchdowns. Georgia will finish the regular season at home against Georgia Tech. Don't miss a play from your favorite team. Download the free SEC mobile app. Stay connected to the place that's all SEC all the time, right here on the SEC Digital Network.